Hey fams, it's your boy back with another one. This is my neon philodendron that I'm going to give a very dramatic haircut to. I filmed all of this last night, but I was feeling a little bit lazy because it was late and I figured I'll just get up tomorrow morning and I'll do the voiceover thing. So this is me getting up tomorrow morning, doing the voiceover thingy. I'm one coffee deep, the second coffee's brewing, and while that's happening, I thought I could do the voiceover thingy for this neon philodendron. Now, that was me giving it some water. I'm gonna to top it up with some worm castings and I'm gonna put some more water on top of those worm castings, hoping that all of that nutrients will drain down into the plant because the plant is gonna need it because again, I'm gonna give it a pretty dramatic haircut. Now, about a month and a half, two months ago, I bought three plants uh, that are exactly like this one, all neon philodendrons, and they were all pretty big, bushy, and leggy, and I, I got a whole bunch of propagations when I first got the plants in. Those propagations are ready to be put into dirt. So, to keep the propagation rotation happening, I thought, what a great time to um, cut this neon philodendron up get a whole bunch of cuttings, put them in jars, put them in water, put them on the propagation shelf. That way I've always got some neon philodendron ready to be pot or propagated. And as you can see, this one is very big, bushy and leggy, just trying to find the, uh, the right vine. Um, takes a bit of time. So that's me speeding everything up and just chopping everything up. I've got like two nodes per cutting at least. You know, giving each cutting the best chance to um, shoot roots. And when these guys are ready, in about a month, I can either flip them or I can give them to some friends or I don't think I'm going to keep them because I've already got like three of these plants. So yeah, I'll probably just, I don't know, I'll figure it out when I figure it out. But anyway, the other cuttings are ready to go into dirt. So that's me, all done. I left this vine because it's uh, got a few different offshoots and I'm wanting them to grow. But yeah, as you can see, very dramatic haircut. And that's one of the jars. That's another one. That's another one. That's another one. And that's another one. So I got five separate jars with all of the offcuts there. And that was my last night. Thanks so much, fams. Follow for more.